And welcome back to Show Me St. Louis. The kids are back in school and fall is just around the corner, so you might be looking to bring out some new decor. Well, luckily you can get in the spirit and stay in budget too. Shannon Hale is the face behind the Daily DIYer. This popular YouTube channel teaches people how anyone can turn everyday beautiful items into beautiful home decor, all while saving money. And Shannon joins us live this morning. Thank you so much for coming on the show. So this is incredible because, as you mentioned, everyday beautiful items. What kind of craft do we have here? Yes, so I love to craft with things you can get already around your house, keep it budget friendly, thrift store. I love shopping at Dollar Tree, but we're getting into fall now, so I brought a really simple and easy fall decor piece that anybody can make today. Anyone can do. Okay, yes. so this is the end result. Yes, and it doesn't take very long to yes. get there. And it's beautiful. It's and, and you even had sent us a picture of it at night and the lights kind of sparkle, but let's yeah, get into how sure. easy this is. Well, this is actually a tomato cage. It's really, okay. really affordable. Yes. So maybe you have some in your garage. If not, head to the hardware store and you just flip it upside down. And I've already kind of started the process up okay. here. You just want to bend and hook down the points on your tomato cage. Okay. And then you'll take a zip tie, kind of get it started. You gather these together. Okay, we're gonna gather those up with our zip tie. And we're gonna just tighten that, and that's gonna give us the shape of okay. a topiary. Okay. Of course, you wanna trim that off, but we can do that at the end. Yes. So all you do is you take some lights here. I actually have this, made this even more simple. This is yeah. some leaf garland with some lights on it already. So it's just kind of a one-step process. Okay. And you take some zip ties, and you just kinda of go around your tomato cage. All right, go around the tomato cage. And, and how uh, how far apart should the zip ties be? You know, you don't have to use too many because they're okay. going to stay pretty good. So just kind of where you want them. Okay. And kind of the trick here is too, depending on how full you want your tomato yeah. cage, you're going to add more to it or less to it. And you just kind of keep stringing your garland. Oh, this is, around this is easy. Up. This is easy. It is so easy. So it's just taking these pretty fall lights and it's, yep. it's a simple tomato cage. And it's a simple tomato cage. Yes. And your page really does do a lot of things like this where you do go to Dollar General. I mean, talk about life hacks because people yes. want that pretty home, but sometimes it comes at a cost. Right. And you don't have to spend a lot. You can use yes. things from affordable stores like Walmart or like I said just grab something from around your house I've done so many videos on everyday items like cutting boards pool noodles ice cube trays so you can really take some everyday items and make them have different purposes yes and luckily this is a lot easier than than trivia you don't even need you don't need to no. know how tall the arches this is so <laughs> simple it's right. actually kind of a peaceful process you just take yeah. it around and zip tie that up and are you going to clip all of these zip ties then yep and then you just come in okay. with some you know heavy duty yes. pliers or scissors and you just trim those tails off and kind of makes wow. your zip ties disappear. That easy. The great thing about this project too is it's mess free. So yes. <laughs> you don't yes. make a big mess while you're doing it. And real quick, you were saying that you have other uses for yes. the tomato cages. Yes, so my most recent video on my channel, The Daily DIYer, is hacking tomato cages. So I actually have a video filled with seven different ideas. So grab yourself some tomato cages, head on over to my site, check out that video. And there's so many cute things for fall every day. There's even a Christmas. Oh, I DIY love that, especially there. because seasonally, you just want those things to pop out for the time of the year. You don't want to spend a ton of money. So right. a, a great hack. It is beautiful. It looks even more incredible at night. Perfect for your porch. You're not going to want to miss it. Take a look at your screen here for further information from Crafts from Shannon on YouTube. Be sure to give her a follow because that's how we found her. And let's just say our homes got a lot prettier. All right. Thank you so much, Shannon, for yeah, joining us this you. morning. And we'll be right back.